my channel my name is key and as you guys can see by the title of the video i am going to be sharing five different ways that i rock my hair wraps really easy very simple other than these three minutes tops and i really feel like these styles are really good for starter locks especially short starter locks because i mean we really can't do much to it later down the line i am going to play with some scarves and come up with different hairstyles not hairstyles come up with different hair wrap styles for when my hair gets longer so i can share with you guys so i feel like the other technical um, hair wrap styles are for those that have long hair because when your hair is longer you can like use your hair as like a bun or you can do like a pineapple and so on my hair is not that long right now so i feel like these styles are really good for the hairstyles that i'm going to not, i keep on saying hairstyles these head wrap styles <laughs> are really good for my length so i'm so happy to go ahead and share with you guys this is the head scarf that i am going to be using it is a satin silk scarf very soft and it's pretty long yeah it's pretty long and it's very lightweight which i really love and i did purchase this from the beast by store for about three or four bucks it was really cheap and i really wouldn't recommend using the cotton scarves because it can definitely dry out your hair you want something that's going to leave moisture in your locks and on your scalp especially when you moisturize your scalp so but here's a little tip if you want to use like a cotton scarf because i know it comes in different um patterns and colors it's really really much cuter than silk scarves let's be honest i would use a silk scarf underneath and then put a cotton scarf on top so that you can use your scarf especially if that's the only kind that you have all right so also wanted to tell y'all i i don't really do my edges like that i'm not really an edge type of girl maybe later down the line but i do like to like slick down my sideburns i don't know if y'all can see it for real I like to slick down my sideburns every time. I always try to. And also, I don't even know what this is, but I kind of try to slick down what I can. And I had used this um, this edge control that I got from the beauty supply store the other day. Very cheap, about three bucks. I don't, you know, I, I don't need nothing expensive. Whichever edge control that you prefer. And also, Eco Styler Gel. This is the organ oil kind. You can use the olive oil or the clear kind as well, whichever you prefer. But, you know, if you want to leave out your edges, I think that's a good idea because it just makes your hair wraps look more sleek and stand out more. I'm not sure the proper title of these hair wraps, <laughs> so I'm just going to call it what I call it, all right? If y'all know, then leave some comments down below. So now I'm going to go ahead and do the low bun hair wrap. This is definitely my go-to. It's super cute. Uh, I just love it so much. All right, so you're going to go ahead and grab your scarf as so. <laughs> and as you guys can see in the front of the scarf, you can see the lining right here, which I am not a big fan of. So what I am going to do is go ahead and tuck it so I can hide it. I just feel like it just gives it more of a cleaner sleep. Oh, and I forgot to tell y'all, I'm wearing a, a wig cap, okay? Wearing a wig cap. So, y'all don't have to, but if y'all don't want your locks just being all over the place, then definitely do that. It's really, like, easier for people with short locks. So, yeah. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and turn around and show y'all what I'm doing. I'm going to go ahead and tie this in the back as so, like this. All right, you wanna make sure it's tight, but not too tight. And you wanna make sure that everything is laid down. You don't want any, any of the scarf sticking up. All right, so now I'm going to go ahead and twist it in the back. I'm not gonna twist it too much because I still want some of the material to be out so now we're going to twist it around so i'm going to hold on to the back 
of the bun as I'm doing it because I don't want the bun to like stick out like a unicorn. And now I'm going to go ahead and stick it inside as so. Super cute. So this is my bun. like it really really cute and I like to keep some hair out so I can show that I have some locks it's really really cute all right so now we're going to do our second style and honestly <laughs> it's so simple y'all like I said these these head wrap styles are super simple super easy so let me go ahead and fix this i want to make sure that it's tucked all the way so i don't have to keep trying to maneuver it all right so this one i'm going to call it the side pony the side pony so so i'm going to go ahead and tie it again and then I'm going to move it to the side. I'm going to move it to the left side. And then I'm going to tie it again so it, does, it doesn't undo. Okay. I'm going to tuck that in because I don't want anything sticking out. So yeah, very simple. It's really cute. And in one of my thumbnails, y'all can see that I have this style, this hair up style one of my thumbnails it's really cute and very simple definitely can't go wrong with this all right so the next one is very similar <laughs> basically the same thing so besides doing it to the side we're going into it to the middle okay like a, a low ponytail so I'm gonna call this the low ponytail so we're just gonna go ahead and Tuck it again. All right, you want to tie it tight, but don't tie it too tight to where you're going to give yourself a headache, okay? We don't want that. And then we're going to tie it again so that it stays in place. This is the ponytail, the low ponytail. Super cute and very easy. And honestly, it's okay if it's like even in the back, like it really don't matter, like honestly, like so yeah, super cute. Then we're gonna go ahead and do her other style, which is also my go-to. This is the bun in the front. Like everybody and their mama do this style, okay. So, I'm going to go ahead. Alright, so this is what I'm going to do. I am going to go ahead and twist it. If you want to tie it in the front like I did, like the other styles, you can go ahead and do that. But, I'm not going to do that. So, I'm going to go ahead and twist it as so. Kind of like the low bun. But, I'm not going to twist it all the way to the bottom. Probably until I get to the middle so I can get like that little twist effect and it doesn't have to be perfect that's the thing about these these styles it don't have to be perfect oh let me start over okay let's make sure nothing is sticking out okay all right usually when I do my blends I'll be going really fast but for the video I'm going slow <laughs> All right, so you see what I mean by the twist effect? Y'all can see that. And then, still holding it down so it doesn't look like a uh, um, a unicorn. It's, now I'm going to go ahead and tuck it in so it can stay in place. You don't need any type of like rubber band or a scrunchie or anything like that or any hairpins. 
just gotta tuck it in and it's still gonna it's gonna stay in place like you can move your head like like a crazy person and it's going to stay in place <laughs> yeah, so this is let me go ahead and play with it a little bit more all right so this is the one in the front this is for cute definitely my go-to you can wear this style when doing a um i don't know when you want to go take your kids to the daycare when you need to go run some errands you know go to the dmv go to the grocery store Hmm, the go-to slap it on keep it moving all right so now we're gonna go ahead and do our last style all right so I'm going to make sure that I tuck it in so I don't see the lining hands are so slippery <laughs> okay so I'm gonna tuck it in or well, tie it rather as so tight not too tight Now let me go ahead and redo that because it's uneven. Yeah, this style don't want it to be uneven too much. Okay, yeah, that's better. <laughs> Alright, so this is what we're gonna do. So we're gonna grab it like two little ponytails and then you're going to twist it as so. Like two little pigtails. Alright, so now you're going to grab it and bring it to the side. Bring one of them to the side. So let me twist it a little bit more. We'll bring this one to the side and then we're going to twist it and then we're going to tie a knot. Alright, and now we're going to tuck it. We're tucking everything, y'all. Alright, so I did notice. Hold on. So now I'm going to just go ahead and get my edge control because I didn't know it's like throughout the video. My little edge, like this is. I don't really have enough hair out right there. That's how you know, like, we ain't even supposed to be doing no baby hairs. Like, we are grown. <laughs> but now. Okay, so this is my little edge brush. I'm going to. So that makes it look 10 times better. I got some of the gel in my fingernails. All right, so of course, as you can see, it makes it look 10 times better with the, you know, little edges or whatever. So yeah.
I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Which one was your favorite style? Leave some comments down below. As I stated, this style. Why well, keep saying style? I guess it is a style. Which hair wrap? style was your favorite so leave it down below i definitely would like to know if you haven't already make sure you guys go ahead and subscribe to my channel and like this video as well and press the bell so that you guys can stay notified i truly hope that you guys enjoyed these five hair up hairstyles go ahead and try it on yourself and yeah so thank you so much for tuning in stay tuned for more videos I'm gonna take you right there